my favorite sports memory in Richmond Hill. Uh, it had to start with preparing for 1988 when the reins were kind of handed over to me. Uh, that was a huge challenge because they were already very good. But with Olympics being in Canada, I knew they really had a good chance to win. We choreographed in the month of, the end of May and the month of June. Every day we were here. And it was so much fun. A lot of hard work and a lot of laughter. The, the whole year was very, very, very exciting for me and an extreme highlight in my life. Uh, it's really a great honor and a very unexpected honor, and I think that makes it all the more exciting. Um, I was lucky to spend a lot of the latter part of my career teaching here in Richmond Hill and uh, working with some of our top ice dancers from across Canada. Oftentimes, it's the dedication and the stick to itiveness. I've seen many skaters that were not supremely talented rise to the top because they were such hard workers and diligent and loved it and did it for all the right reasons. So I would just say, if you love it, uh, whatever sport it is, listen to your coaches, be open-minded, work hard, um, and just go for your dream.